uh, the problem 4.7.11. So when you determine the uh, four unknowns A, B, C, and D as the coefficients for this quadrature rule, so they can reach the highest degree of precision as three. Uh, again, this is because we have four unknowns to determine, and it can determine, uh, so it will help this equation to be exact for all the polynomials degree up to three, because uh, those polynomials, uh, polynomials will have four unknowns. Okay, so we'll match the number of unknowns. Okay, so that means we want this equation to be true for uh, these four cases, and we just need to plug in f equals uh, one of the each one of these four, like here. And then on the right hand side, we just uh, use these uh, polynomials or this uh, function functions f. And on the right hand side, we will have, for example, when f is just equal to one, then on this right hand side, this is just a times one because f is constant one. And b times 1 plus c times uh, constant 1 take a derivative will be just 0. So the same here will be 0. So that's why for this case, we'll just have a plus b. On the right-hand side, we should have f equals to 1. So we just need to take an integral of that, and uh, we'll get 2. So we got one equation. So just, doing, just do this for each of these four, and we'll get four equations. And these four equations are like this. And we just need to solve for the constants a, b, c, and d and uh, we'll get these results.